Stephanie McMahon truly should be the fig. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. Tracks challengers who are ready to throw all caution to the wind, who are ready to put their body. Now, oh, this is going to be good. Without a doubt, one of the greatest Lucha Libre stars in sports entertainment history. Break out your notepads because we are about to receive a master class in high flying. Making her way to the ring. Accompanied by Maurice, representing the Bella Twins from San Diego, California, the NXT Women's Champ to Ontario, Canada, the Raw Women's Champion, Trish Stratus. From a man. The New Day from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 285 pounds. Pounds. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on so. And or you'll miss Nathan Frazier. And from Jersey in the Channel Islands, weighing in at 182 pounds, Nathan Frazier. Nathan Frazier, a stand out of NXT UK, one of the most entertaining competitors in the history of that brand. And from Panama City, Florida, weighing in at 204 pounds, Adam Cole Danielson. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, you're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. Title attracts challengers who are ready to throw all caution to the wind, who are ready to put their body aggression. And introducing the champion from Worcester, Massachusetts, weighing in at 270 pounds. He is the NXT champion. 
And you can feel the electricity in here for this match. The WWE fans on. Well, look, right in front of us. No, no, no. Turn around. Turn around. From out of the WWE Universe comes their opponent, who now has a clear advantage, and the bell hasn't even rung yet. Well, we're going to start the match like this? If you on the independent circuit of the United Kingdom in 1977 has influenced countless superstars of today. Pure evil in the eyes of the big red machine. Oh, and this place are hot. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from West Newbury, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 248 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, John. Fever pitch upon their arrival and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the... Now the matchup underway. Oh, the referee, the official's down. And these two don't care at all. What, what about the official? Someone check on him, please. One of the most powerful superstars in history. An all-time great and the pride of England. The British Bulldog, one of the most powerful wrestlers in the history of WWE. Made his debut on the independent circuit of the United Kingdom in 1977. Has influenced countless superstars of today.
The Big Red Machine is here. You know, for years, WWE fans wondered what was under the mask. Now they probably regret even asking what was under the mask. Pure evil in the eyes of the big red machine. Oh, and this place was hot. The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match and is for the ECW World Television Championship. Introducing the challenger from Manchester, England, weighing in at 260 pounds, the British Bulldog, Davy Boy Smith. And his opponent, from the pits of hell, weighing in at 323 pounds, he is the ECW World Television Champion, Kane! Looking at the champion, I guarantee there is no doubt in their mind as to who is leaving this match with the title around their waist. And Hell in a Cell is known as the place in WWE where rivalries are settled forever. It is the absolute last resort for a coach that will not die. If it can't be settled inside Hell in a Cell, you have to take it up with God himself as far as I'm concerned. Saw that one coming. superstar that can turn that switch and battle on pure instinct because a strategy could be lost and all you have left is the ability to fight and that can happen quickly in an environment where cruelty is rewarded for having no bounds as we all know hell in a cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring well timed maneuver there taking this one back to the ring now taking this match off the mat now On the top, and nobody's there. Set him up, Russian leg sweep. Going for a pin for the championship. And a kick out before even one there. He is still very much in this. And Vicious right forearm. Military Prince! Ooh. Someone called a dentist. Out of the ring and even closer to the chain link enclosure. He's heading back to the ring. Right across the larynx. A bad place to be for the challenger. And this is where Hell in a Cell earns its name, people. The damage is just piling up as we head into deep waters. And 
he's able to fight Kane off. right by those cell walls. Oh! Ooh. You gotta be kidding me. Wild guess. I don't think anyone involved expected that to happen. Well, if we know anything about Hell in a Cell, we know that things are only going to get much worse from here on out. If you're looking for danger, you have come to the right place. Amen. I wasn't looking. And now he's making his way up the side of the cell. Guys, he clearly has no regard for his own right hand. He gave you the first hit, Byron. He's on top. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the pro Now the backbreaker. This is excruciating. Oh, what an escape. Tough position to be caught. to pay to get said answer. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing and it could cost him. British Bulldog has a lot of bark in this one, but will he get some bite in return? He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing and it could cost him. British Bulldog has a lot of bark in this one, but will he get some bite in return? Oh, uh, looks like an act of desperation. A big one. Here he goes, right up the side of the cell. Making it look easy. He's made it up there, guys. No one, please don't come back down. Imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going to dig deeper at this point? It might just take that extra push, that extra inch further to create. All the way up and down. A choke slam. Now that is why they're the champ. When you hold this much contempt for your opponent, you'll do anything you have to to drag him to hell. Whatever's playing here, can't be good. The power ball. And with the grip. All the way up to the top. This championship match just turned into a crime scene. I don't know how this match can go on. Ooh! Chilling assault from the Big Red Monster. Kane cannot be stopped right now. And he's able to counter. Going into the cover of the title. Oh, new champion! New champion! I was not expecting that from him at this point. Ooh. These superstars must be feeding off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to run. Oh, using your head to counter that. Shoulders up. You see the look on the 
challenger's favor. The superstars get right back in this match. It's almost unbelievable what we're seeing with our own eyes. Believe it, Corey. Believe it. Back body drop. Exclamation point. Thunders. Out of the ring and into hell itself. Oh, no. Come on. Don't use a sledgehammer. Think of the children. He went right into that turnbuckle. Bulldog's attack gets reversed. Here comes Kane! The big red monster! Look at that sidewalk slam! And look at Kane now, perching himself up top. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. From the top, diving clothesline by Kane. to give everything you've got. I don't know how much you can have left after that, but you've got to be impressed. All the way up and down, and down with the choke slam. Makes the cover. Will the rain continue? And the champ stands tall once again. Here is your winner, and still, the ECW World Television Champion, Kane! What a win for him here. He really displayed his prowess in victory. No doubt about it, support for this guy grows by the second in the estimation of the WWE Universe.